Hi friends, welcome to my channel. Today, let's solve some simple EOQ problems, that is economic ordering quantity problems. Now, let us look at the problem. So, the first problem is, from the following information, calculate the EOQ of a particular component. Annual demand is equal to 1250 units, ordering cost is equal to rupees 40 per order, and inventory carrying cost is rupees 1 per unit. The question is also given in the description. So now let's solve this problem. It is a very easy problem. So what is the information given? Annual demand is given. So annual demand A. Is it just annual demand? No. It is annual demand of raw materials. Of raw materials. We should always remember it is annual demand of raw materials. Why? Because at times, instead of raw materials, they may give us other information such as finished good. And if we substitute that information here, our answer will go wrong. So, it is A is annual demand of raw materials in units. And here they have given us the value. It is 1250 units. Now, the next one. B. What is B? B is buying cost. Or ordering cost, buying cost or ordering cost. Is it just buying cost or ordering cost? No. Then what is it? It is buying cost or ordering cost per order. So it is buying cost or ordering cost per order. We have to always remember it is buying cost or ordering cost per order. Hence the value given in the question is rupees 40 per order. Rupees 40 per order. And the next information given is inventory carrying cost. Inventory carrying cost C is rupees 1 per unit. So is C just carrying cost? No, it is carrying cost per unit. It is carrying cost per unit. And the information given here is it is equal to rupees 1 per unit. So, it is always important to remember the full form of each and every letter. So, here A means annual demand of raw materials. We should always remember it is annual demand of raw materials. B means it is buying cost or ordering cost per order. And C means it is carrying cost per unit. Now, we have substituted the values. Now, we have to calculate the EOQ. So, what is the formula for EOQ? The formula for EOQ is EOQ is equal to root of 2AB by C. So, we calculated the value of A, B and C, right? We didn't calculate it. It was given in the question. But now we will substitute it. So, the value of A is rupees 1000, uh, sorry, value of A is 1250 units. B is rupees 40 per order and C is carrying cost that is rupees 1 per unit. Now we will use a calculator and find the answer. It is root of 1 lakh. So what is root of 1 lakh? Using a calculator we found out the answer. It is 316.22 units. Now, we can't order 0.22 units, right? So, we will use the estimation. So, it is 316 units per order. It is 316 units per order. So, what is economic ordering quantity? It is the most uh, cost efficient ordering quantity. So, in one order, we have to order 316 units. So, in one order that we place, we have to place order for 316 units. Now, let's solve another problem. The question is again given in the description. So, let's look at the next problem. The next question is, data relating to slotted angles in a steel furniture manufacturing unit is as follows. Half yearly demand is equal to 1000 units. 
half yearly demand is equal to 1000 units ordering cost is equal to rupees 62.5 per order inventory carrying cost is equal to rupees 2 per unit we have to calculate the eoq per order in units so let's solve so a what is a a is annual demand of raw materials in unit so in this information what is given in the question they have given the demand for half yearly so half yearly demand is given so uh, for ha uh, for 6 months the demand is 1000 units so then what will be the demand for one year one year is 12 months right for 6 months if it is 1000 units then for 12 months it would be double of uh, the number the requirement for 6 months right so 2 into 1000 units that is 2000 units so annual demand for raw materials and units is 2000 units 2 into half yearly demand now what is b that is buying cost or ordering cost per order here they, they have given it is rupees 62.5 so buying cost or ordering cost is rupees 62.5 per order always remember it is per order now see what is carrying cost inventory carrying cost is rupees 2 per unit so they have given the inventory carrying cost to be rupees 2 per unit now let's solve this problem a b and c we found the value of a b and c now to find eoq it is very simple right we just have to know we just need to know the formula so what is the formula for eoq the formula for eoq is root of 2 a b by c so root of 2 a b by c is equal to root of 2 into 2000 into 62.5 by c that is rupees 2 per unit now use a calculator and find out the answer it is 2,50,000 root of 2,50,000 by 2 which is equal to root of 1,25,000 so what is root of 1,25,000 Using a calculator, we found out the answer to be 353.55 units. Now we can estimate it to the nearest value. So it is 354 units per order. So uh, what is EOQ? EOQ is equal to 354 units per order that is whenever we place an order we have to place order for 354 units i hope you understood these two questions these two questions uh, are very easy questions it helped you understand the concept of how to solve an eoq problem in the next video we will solve little more tougher questions so please watch that video also if you liked our video, please like and subscribe. Thank you.